Greetings, Nelson here today with another instructional video. As always, these videos are for instructional purposes only. Use at your own risk. Um, today we'll be updating or upgrading the BIOS of a Dell Inspiron 3521. Um, when I do BIOS upgrades, I like to do so from a live or an install um, Windows 7 uh, CD DVD. I already have that inserted, um, so I'm going to select it and boot from it. This machine does not have Windows installed, and I have the appropriate um, 3521. Um, currently, I'm at A12 BIOS, and I would like to go to A14. And I have that downloaded and on a USB stick that is already inserted in the computer. Okay, that's important that um, um, that be uh, in the system when you boot the um, installation media. Now, I um, choose to uh, do my BIOS upgrades this way because by booting from the Windows installation media, it gives you a very clean and pristine environment to perform the upgrade. Um, there are many, many things that could um, create issue by um, doing it from your local uh, installation. And this just gives a, a clean room environment to do it. To get started on that first screen, we click Next. I'm going to select over here in the bottom left, Repair Your Computer. Uh, on this next screen that comes up, I just click Next, Cancel, and then Cancel again. And this brings up our system recovery options. Down here at the bottom, I'm going to choose Command Prompt. So this is where we've got our clean environment. And uh, we're going to launch um, the uh, appropriate BIOS Update EXE. In some of my other videos, people are very interested in these DOS commands that I am typing. I'm going to take just a moment, I'm going to zoom my camera in, and get it to where you can see the commands that I'm typing for those that want to see them. Okay, just a bit more adjusting. There we go. Now, as you can see, the drive letter currently is X. Okay. I believe if you had a Windows operating system installed on the computer, you probably wouldn't want to guess the first available drive letter to be C. But since I do not, I'm going to guess that the first available drive letter that it's going to assign to my USB key is going to be C. Okay, And I'm going to do a DOS command of DIR to get a directory listing. And I have guessed correctly. Um, if you can see there that um, here is my um, BIOS uh, EXE file. Just a bit more, Jesse. Maybe zoom back out just a little for you. And that's the file I'm going to launch, okay? So I'm going to type that in. I'm going to zoom back out now because that's what I'm going to run, okay? So allow me to zoom back out and readjust my camera so we can see what's going on here. Just a bit of adjustment. So don't be overwhelmed, please, by those uh, DOS commands. Uh, I'm doing nothing more than navigating to where my BIOS um, upgrade file is, and then I'm going to launch it. Okay, and as you can see right there on the screen, it's telling me... I'm going to move this out of the way just a little bit here. As you can see, um, the ID is at Ellen Spurron 3521. I am at A12 and I'm going to go to 814. Um, it gives us a screen here, talks about some information that you need to understand. Um, uh, these are important things. Please read and understand these. Okay. I have read and understand them. I'm going to click OK. And this is where the um, the flashing or the updating or the upgrading of the BIOS, uh, it should um, perform a small step, come back into the BIOS screen, actually perform the uh, upgrade on the BIOS and then we should see the system reboot again. So let's give it a go here. And all this is expected I believe.
The system is booting up here. Looks like it's performing, and there we are. This is now flashing our BIOS. I'll zoom in just a bit so you can see that. It's kind of blurry on my camera. I'm not sure what you can see, but we are going from A12 to A14. It's at 51%, and there's another step it performs after this one. And then we should see the BIOS um, and the system reboot. And so that says 100. There's a little wait time. It's got to perform this step here. And uh, when this step has completed, uh, we should see the system reboot. I'm going to try and see if I can get up here. I'll do F2 for setup. And I'm going to try and see if I can show you in this top corner here this the BIOS did in fact upgrade. Let's see if I can get that for you. And here we are. And there we go. Inspiron 3521A14. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this instructional video, and uh, as always, um, perhaps you'll watch another.